everybody and welcome back to my channel we are on sunrock today um right so i just looked it looks like we're fixing the train window still uh and i had a message just as i logged in saying the mystery man has appeared so we're gonna try and find him see if he's the same one as portia so um let's go Right, finally loaded. <laughs> Takes so long. Right, so which furnace have I got? Nope, that's copper. Oh. I was going to say. So, I got my glass. I think I was still, um... Trying to upgrade my work table as well, wasn't I? I have nothing. <laughs> oh, I have them. Uh, okay, I need one more hardwood stick. Can I make? Yay! I can craft one. Mm. Need some more copper wire. How many have I got? I already own five, so I need five. Right, anyway, let's go and repair the train. Have I got a commission as well? I need to do. I pressed the wrong button. Oh, I have. Um. Oh yes, I got to do them as well. Put Owen. Go and have a look at why they do them. Go. And I gotta go talk to Yan. Looks like he's over in the Commerce Guild. Why do people have to be inside? That means I have to come back outside. <laughs> so how we're all, how are we all? Hopefully the weather's nice where you are. It's raining on and off here, so... <laughs> I'll fix that window, eh? Oh, splendid! Another fine contribution to Sandrock on behalf of the Commerce Guild. I'm sure they'll have a few kind words to throw my way at the next fireside, eh? No, I fixed it, not you. Gets on my nerves. <laughs> right. Ow, I keep forgetting about that. I... Woke up one morning <laughs> with um, a painful knuckle. Now, I haven't banged it, haven't hit anybody. <laughs> and it was just really painful. And it keeps doing this every so often. It's really, really painful. So I think I might have... Because um, of the nature of my job, my... my full-time job that I tell you about quite often it's very you use your hands a lot um so maybe it's just a bit of arthritis I have to go to the doctors about it sometime but <laughs> I'm too busy I'm too busy at the moment oh gosh it's so busy at work but hey can't moan no, I can but I shouldn't but I do <laughs> very contradicting aren't I <laughs> but yeah so yeah just one of those things keep earning the money I wish it was as easy as working in Sandrock though I'll just do a commission get some money do another commission get some money instead of having the daily slog but hey ho 
I shouldn't though. Let's go and have a dust of everything. Oh look, I ran over there when I got me horse. Oh. Oh yeah, I was trying to get old parts, wasn't I? Well, I'm not going to clean much, am I? Yeah, be like that then. <laughs> right. Okay, so... Oh, no, 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 no. That's done. Right. What do I need for two of these? I need some basic leather. I need... I just need basic leather then. Okay. So if I... Um... E. Uh, what is it? R to cycle through. Right. So that's... So basic leather is on the work table. So I need some of that. Mm -hmm. Right. Get on my horse. <laughs> ah! Yeah, can't get, I can't. find the mystery man. For our quizzically question clientele, don't be afraid to stop by City Hall for tourist information. seem to find him. I need to go and see Owen. Oh. last time. <laughs> I'm sure I got it then. Oh, was that for the um the Jew collector? Oh well oh, just suddenly got more tired. <laughs> Blue moon to go I am going to have I don't know ten. Yeah. 
Let's sort my inventory out again. I do. I need to sort my inventory out. So, I have been reading that a lot of people have uh, now come to the end of the early access content. Um, it'll probably take me a while still to get through to that. Um, <laughs> I was looking at how many hours I've played this and how many hours I played Porsche. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Porsche. It's gonna take a while for me to play Sandrock as much as I did. I have Porsche because it's like six hundred and twenty-four hours. <laughs> There's probably people that have played it a lot more than me, um, but that's a lot of hours uh, for me to have played a game. And as I said, I played most of it during the uh, lockdown because um, I was on furlough. Um, so. I'm not anymore. I'm back at work and very, very, very busy. Um, so yeah, as I said, in uh, two or three weeks, uh, I will be going on holiday. But don't worry, I will be putting up content for you still on a Tuesday, a Thursday, and the Sunday. So I will not forget about you, wonderful people. Oh, Jasmine, be careful. That's it. Just run into the sort of. Yay! Oh yeah, I got an upper ranking, haven't I? Um, mechanical. Have I got any mechanical scrap? No. Uh, leather. Also get waylaid. See, the ones that I was told were the chickens, but I'm going to go up here a minute, if I can get in. Yep. Church. That's my dog, don't worry. She's decided the floor's too hard now. Took her to the groomers today. She, she smells all lovely now. Her nails clipped because they were getting so dew claws because they she doesn't do much with her dew claws they get really really um long and as I, I'm part of a retired um where did my horse go um I'm, I'm on a Facebook Page or member on a Facebook page, and yeah, if you don't keep them dew claws down, they can get them caught and rip them off, and it's very painful for them. So I, uh, I do try and make sure you know I take her to our local groomer. We we know her quite well. Um, get her sorted. mechanical scraps so let's just recycle that can I make more marble oh. oh yeah I need a marble brick 
<laughs> I need I need hard stones. <laughs> really? My image is full? Are you telling me? in the wrong button. Yeah, I know. I'm going around killing chickens. Oh, I know. I need eight. 
I don't know how I'm going to get eight. Or I need more than that, don't I? I wonder if um, Vivi's got some. I'll go see if Vivi's got some. Is it Vivi? I'm sure it's Vivi at Taylor Made. <laughs> oh, because I gotta find this mystery man because he's only around for two days, or he used to be in Porsche. You got an itchy face again. I can't see what she's doing behind me. <laughs> oh, oh. Ow, ow. <laughs> Got him. Anybody would think I was thinking old. <laughs> Not that old. <laughs> Getting there slowly. I bet some of the kids though today would say, God, you're old. And I'd be like, yeah, I know, and I don't care. From the church. Dear Lizzie, no doubt you're aware the Day of Memories is coming up on the 27th. Oh. For the next seven days, up until the day of the festival, there will be special commissions available on the commissions board. We need all the help we can get to decorate getting the decorations ready so if it, it ain't too much trouble please do stop over at the commission board okie dokie um yeah um nope wrong one what's the ow not five days left and i still need lots and lots and lots of leather right you horse come here we go over to Wondering Why. And we go to Vivi's. That's just not good enough. <laughs> I'll just sit here for a couple of minutes. There we go. Oh. Right, now go to babies. I thought everybody would be going up to the temple. Sorry, I'm just playing my horse. 
Oh, is he at the church? One day I will get to know how to get to these places. Yes, I know my inventory is full, but guess what? I, I'm going to empty it in a minute. <laughs> You got that done quickly. Here's your payment. You earned it. Oh, I obtained an award. Always pay attention to the amount of water in your workshop water tank. I, I, I didn't. I didn't. I'm a bad, bad. Bad builder. Bad, bad builder. Jim. <laughs> uh, We've just come into July. And I'm like... I said to my husband. I said, we're in July. Now, what is happening with the weather? It's still cold, it's still wet, it's... Uh, it's like, it's like we're still in April or something. It's not like we're in July. is okay <laughs> got, st got stuck in a wall um <laughs> that was to uh, teach me to jump off roofs yeah um so yeah why is the weather so ew <laughs> 12 thin thread yep i can do that uh what else can i do I can make hardwood planks now. Right. Uh, right. I've got two commissions. <laughs> That's good. More money for me. Because I think it's about five hours. About five, oh, was it five or one? One or five thousand to to expand out oh, my land. <laughs> Might have to take me. Oh. Thing is, I have a watch that counts my steps. But the thing is, is after some time it irritates and I have to take it off. Mason still doesn't want to go. 
Look, you you should be in Porsche. I've already met you in Porsche. Oh yeah, I never made any marble for it, did I, in the end? Three. Hmm, that ain't gonna get me far. Hardwood planks. I can make one. So, I need to go to the recycler. And I need fine wood scrap. I have none of. Great. Okay. You, horse, come with me. I'm gonna go get some quality wood scrap. Yeah. run Yeah, so as you can see, I'm just running around uh, trying to get marble and uh, wood um, because I, I I need some wood for a commission. Hello, Coco. The right button. I haven't done much this episode, have I? I'm still pressing the mouse button because that's what I'm so used to doing. to the devs 
Can we go back to pressing mouse buttons to get on and off the horse? and see what we can do. Let's make a thin thread. Because I have four, I can make five. Uh, I still need twelve. where to get pound five, but I probably did. That's a lot. No, it's not really, actually. Bronze... I was going to say bronze flame then. Bronze frame... Oh, that sounds awesome. Anyway. I'm getting carried away. Um... So today I didn't do much, I will admit. Um, I I made the commission for Owen. And that's about it. Oh, and I fixed the train. So I fixed the train window and uh, I um, and I did Owen's mission. And now I'm trying to um, get some plant fibre to make some thread. because uh, now we've got special ones. Yay! Um, it's getting late, so Matilda won't be up. So let's wrap it up there. Um, so yeah, um, just done a commission for the day of memories. Uh, I have to take to Matilda. We did uh, a sand rock commission for Owen. We made him two sunshades um, and we fixed the train window. Um, we tried to find the mis mi mi <laughs> mystery man. Why have I got blue arrows? Oh, person of interest. Oh, 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 God, get on the horse. Um, I might meet him. Quick, let's go.
Excuse me, ma'am. Might I have a word? I don't want Ernest. I'm new to Sandrock, and I would be remiss to pass up an opportunity to speak with a dignified-looking damsel such as yourself. My stars! Would you listen to that? I reckon that must be the phrasings of a bona fide Taran gentleman. Ain't nobody talks fancy like that around here. Well, what can I do you for, newcomer? Looking for good eats? Or just a place to kick up your heels? I've been ranching these parts for more than 20 years. Reckon I ought to know a thing or two by now. Just ask our builder here. Hmm. I believe you. I'm Ernest, by the way. I'm here on the behalf of the Atara Times. I was hoping to do a piece on that bandit fellow who's been giving you all so much trouble. Would you care to weigh in on the situation? Oh. I reckon you mean Logan. Mr. Ernie, sir, I, I don't suppose you were on that train, were you? You still want to catch up with that rascal? Well, here's my way in. You'd do best by packing your bags. That Logan's a wanted man, and he likely won't take kindly to a fancy talking, pants wearing, city slicking point Dexter snooping around. No offense. <laughs> uh. If you want to write about something, write about the scenery. Try some of our Yakmal sausage. It's so good. People all the way from Porsche make their way over to stock up on it. <laughs> Logan, forget about it. Wait till the core catches him, then ask him yourself. I never saw Yakmal sausage in Porsche. I'm gonna have to. Mm. <laughs> and it was going so well. <sighs> I've really hit a wall these past few days. Can't seem to get anyone to open up. Are they really so afraid of one guy? Is it my cologne? You, Builder, um... Despite all that, I don't suppose you would be willing to answer some of my questions? About... Logan. I don't really know him. Do I ask away? Do I try asking it? Do I tell him to try asking it? <sighs> I really don't want to get into this now. Well, I can say ask away, but I can't really answer uh, your question. Really? You will? Fantastic! One moment, let me just get out my notebook. No. For this interview, please try to be as objective as possible. Try not to let your feelings or any biases get in the way. It's important that I only get the facts as I try to understand this bandit persona. <laughs> First question. Do you know Logan personally? That's all right. Never Still, met you've lived here for a while, haven't you? I believe your insight may yet be of use. Tell me what he looks like. I mean, have you seen the posters around here? They really couldn't have found a picture of him without a bandana over his face. Just a simple description will do. Hmm. So you've never seen his face either. I got a quick look at him. That disarming glare. Ice cold. I'll never forget it. And even through the bandana, you can see there are stories written on his face, just waiting to be told. Logan's accomplice. The man who helped him on the train. What do you know about him? What's his name? Isn't it that Haru's his oldest friend or something? Haru and Logan... I see... Yes, I noticed that they seem to be close. Each one seemed to know what the other was about to do from just a quick glance. Hmm... So, that's all you know? Well, I appreciate your honesty. As a non-native Sandrocker, I suppose I should have expected as much. But, I can tell you did your best. Thank you. In any case, I suppose this counts as my first complete interview. They sent me here to just do a little throwaway piece for Ernie's World. But this whole bandit thing is gold! My editor Eduardo is gonna flip! Bandits? On your train? It's more likely than you think. Mm, no, that's no good. Ne'er do well nabs, Nada? Uh, no, how cheesy is that? Uh, hey there, kiddo. I seem to keep seeing you around. You're not following me, are you? Are you alright? I'm fine. <laughs> are you lost? Where's your mother? 
I'm not lost. I live here. My ma's in the desert now. Ah, I see. In the desert. Oh, goodness. Sweetie, where do you live? Do you need someone to help you get home? No, um, you're Ernest, the writer. Did you write the Maltese Pigeon? <laughs> oh, you're a fan, huh? Gosh, why didn't you say so? Oh, that book you've got, that's my latest release. Why don't I sign it for you? Oh, that would be great! Thank you, Mr. Ernest! Hey, anything for a fan. Who should I make this out to? Jasmine. That's J-A-S. Uh, huh. And Jasmine, sweetie, why don't you tell me, what was your favorite part about this book? Um, actually, I thought the story this time was a bit contrived. Oh, the sound's not very good at the moment. Eh? Contrived? Wow, such a big girl word. Where did you... I'm not finished. The characters are paper thin. And if you've even been paying half attention, you can see every twist coming from a league away. I think you've been really writing it in lately. Your old stuff was way better. <laughs> well, little kid, with all due respect, you're a little kid and you don't know anything. I'm your primary demographic! Actually, as you can clearly see displayed on the back cover, the book is intended for all ages. Well, that's all the time I have for today. Here you go, and cheerio! Wow, look, Mr. Teddy! We got an autograph from Ernest, the famous writer! Let's put it under our pillow tonight. You really can't please everyone. She's kind of right, though. My novels have only ever really caught on with the under-12 demographic. It's gotten so hard to continue to outdo myself. Uh, the Maltese Pigeon? Eh, sure. Well, the version you might find at a local store, my publishing company shortened it and turned it into a children's book. Perhaps one day, I could show you my original version for the novel. It was nice running into you again, Builder. But I really should get back to work. Despite the one-off critic here and there, plenty of fans are in fact looking forward to what I come up with in Sandrock. So long! Sound went a bit weird then, didn't it? Anyway, it's getting really late now and I'm gonna get Pandorize. So... Right. Anyway, I'm going to leave it there. Sorry about that. I thought it was the mysterious man, but it wasn't. So, as always, if you want to see more content, please subscribe. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to hit that notification bell so you know when I am uploading next. I shall see you next time. Sorry, bye.